nothing to do with the substantive problems of running a government, which is all true, as you know, if you follow the speeches and so-called debates of the candidates. Anyhow, 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 anyhow. One of the guys I was talking with said not a word in the whole conversation, except at the end when he suddenly chuckled and said we were all full of shit, and why didn't we go to gun Russia or China if that was the way we all hated the United States of America? Next thing you know, the whole blooming discussion was more like a brawl, and the out of best and fast, and the noise was incredible. Someone said son of a bitch, and I think he said bastard. I couldn't be sure, it was also confusing. Well, anyhow, I was attempting to get it all back on a rational level. I tried, for example, to talk to the one who had started it all, and I asked him just what did he mean we were all full of shit? Was he making a statement of fact as he knew it, and where was his documentation to back up his claim? I think Socrates would have been proud of the way I refuted his argument, and as I tried to refute it, but all he could offer by way of rebuttal was more of the same about how we were all full of shit, but I couldn't say why he just kept on repeating it. That was the part about Russia and China and communist groups. I have to confess that I got a bit angry and told him to stuff his ideas up his heart, but you don't have to tell me it's hard for you to convince anyone in an argument. Then he got salty and read that he a punch in the mouth if I didn't get up, and I really got hot, and the others did too, and we all beat the shit out of Mr. Conservative. After all, he had only himself to be proud. This is still a free country, and anyone telling a fellow like me, bro, you're full of shit, better be good and ready to answer politely when asked if he'd care to say why.
Low frequency, 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 low frequency